This is how cell tower science works. Basically, each one of those numbers are all different kinds of channels, and we're running an Arduino with an antenna that measures cell towers and all the frequencies coming in my house. So it's from 0 to uh, 1023 on the ADC. And each number represents a channel that oscillates between the next voltage to make a binary frequency for all of the cell phones, for all of the cell phones in the remote area up to like 10 to 20,000. So what happens is really fast in the gigahertz range, each each number, each number will oscillate and tell you a binary string in the gigahertz. And it sends that out per channel, per band that's set to program specific phones in the area. And that's how cell towers work, is they set the phones to operate on specific consecutive bands and each consecutive one which you're seeing consecutive numbers from 0 to 1023 volts which that's just a representation of a volt scale from 0 to 5 volts uh, and actually it's pretty high voltage and it's all over the place and the cell tower is just a few paces away uh, but it's consecutive and they can't do it simultaneously because it'll interfere with the reception. So it has to be consecutive. So it's really fast consecutive binary.